Many see these beautiful anti-magic snails as ten-foot-tall treasure chests. It's not like I don't see why. These things basically sweat money. Their shells are worth up to five thousand gold. They can make special magic items, be turned into sets of shields, ground into dyes for super rare robes. Snails the limit. On top of that, their slime is turned into glass, which is surprisingly valuable. So valuable that some ranchers will follow them around just collecting it. See? No need to hurt the snail. Love the snail. Snail will provide. Wizards do not love the snail. They speak of how dangerous it is. They are correct. If provoked, the snail does not attack and thus a dangerous creature comes very close. They just want to eat rocks and savor tasty crystals. If they do need to attack, they can swing each other five flail snail flails every round. If they're really scared, they'll let loose their shell's magic, a burst of light and color that can stun anything around them and make them harder to hit. Their HP is nothing special, but good luck getting to it for reasons which wizards argue about. Reasons that only matter if you wish to hurt the snail, and you should not hurt the snail. But you will, so I will list them. Mordenkainen tells us that a flail snail's shell is magic resistant and turns spells into small explosions. If pressed, it will retreat into the shell where it cannot move, is bad at hitting you, and you are better at hitting it. He says that they do not lose their flails. He says they do not cry. Bono says differently. Bono says magic will explode on contact or do nothing or reflect back to the caster. He also says that there is no downside to it retreating into its shell during combat. This just makes sense. It can seem fine with Tremor Sense and it's used to having its shell. It belongs there. And when you crush its last tentacle, it will retreat into the shell and bleed out and scream and cry which is sad, but also very dangerous. A Prail Snail Whale is twice as loud as any thunder spell, lasting half an hour and alerting every major predator and enraged snail rancher in the area. So if you do take up the lucrative profession of snail hunting, remember that hunting the snail is dangerous. But what hunts you next might be worse. That's all for today's lesson. Let me know if you liked it and hit that button for more courses. Class dismissed.